tickets. Could you move it more in the center? Yeah. Oh, hold on. I'll do it. Let me do it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And from a, a formal point of view with this piece, I um, was challenged <clears throat> to create different textures with the same uniform paper that I've been using. Did I mention Colorade was a silk screened paper? Okay. Colorade is <clears throat> screen printed on one side, so it's matte and lush and gorgeous. And on the other side, no ink. And um, that's why we cut from the other side. So the blade doesn't dull and it's on a drag uh, and like that. Okay, so with the Colorade paper, for this awning, and a ride that was kind of dilapidated and coming apart. I wanted to um, illustrate a collapsing awning, so I just used a lot of different colors that will close them down here next to one another to create that feeling. The giant wonder wheel, actually which is 100 years old this year, wow. and still going strong, and a lovely family operates it, it's, it's in fabulous condition. Wow. This wonder wheel is 15 stories high, and wow. um, weighs about 250 tons, but it's as delicate as a butterfly. It's incredible. And what I um, attempted to do was to show that airy delicacy in the distance. Okay. And then we have the fence, <coughs> the corrugated fence that's twisted and rusted. And um, what I do was I kind of pulled it forward, you know, and made it dimensional to gain that aspect of it. And that's that's really what Tickets is about, besides being one of my favorite scenes. But everyone was my favorite scene, so it's for it. What was the text on there? What was the text Tickets. Tickets. You see? C-K-E-T-S. Part of, you know, cutting some of the words off has to do with me making a sketch, putting a border around my pad, and, you know, whatever the landscape is, it is, mm -hmm. and the messages surface, no matter what. Um, also, it has to do with, I guess, a couple of thoughts and, and words um, resonating of the, the nature of what was going on there. I'm not really quite sure, but it has a lot to do with that, I think. Is that a bumper car ride? I I've done bumper car. Oh, is this a bumper car ride? Yeah. No, it's the Himalaya. Does anybody know that ride that's under an awning and you know, it, it's like a it's like small a roller coaster. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. and it goes backwards also. It's covered. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it's a really loud blare and music along with it. Yeah. yeah. Right. So um, yeah, that was the Himalaya. So that Wonder Wheel is it made of steel, or you said it's very delicate, like a butterfly? What is it made of? Oh, it's steel. Steel. Yeah. And it was um, built 100 years ago by the eccentric Ferris Wheel Company. Um, it was designed, believe this or not, after a drawing that Leonardo da Vinci did. I just bought a book, a recent book, wow. about facts about the Wonder Wheel, and I'm finding more about it than I ever knew. Wow. Yeah. I love the uh, twilight sky. Mm -hmm. That's a swash I should have of paint. Yeah. I was yeah, becoming bold. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it really sets off the yeah. wonder wheel and also resonates with my own experience at the <clears throat> fair. You know, we always yeah. went yeah. in the evening and had that feel to it. Yeah. And that's what art should do. It should invoke mm -hmm. you know, memory. I like the fence. I like the fence. Yeah, yeah. the fence is great. great too, yeah. The variation in the colors. Yeah. I think one of the things that I'm sorry. Uh, one of the things that when I saw the work, other than the fact that it blew me away that it was all cut paper, um, was that when you see it, and even sitting back here now, if you could, it, it's like the work feels like it's moving. I get a sense of the excitement and the sound and the color and the lights and all of that mm -hmm. because of the way you 
you put the pieces together and you juxtapose the different shapes and the different colors. And so I've never been to Coney Island, but when I see the work, it's almost like I can hear it and experience it. And the work kind of vibrates That's for me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I feel that vibration like we would be on a ride and everything vibrates around mm -hmm. you. And I think you really, I think the work does that. It's it's like an experience, mm -hmm. not just looking at it, but you're kind of experiencing that feeling. And I think that's really special with it. Mm -hmm. And it has a lot of energy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Coney Allen has its own energy. When, when somebody said Disney, Disney has sort of that new... Sanitized. Yeah, yeah. sanitized. And Coney Allen was just kind of... It has a gritty, raw excitement. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like the island of lost I was, boys. I was only there once. <laughs> <laughs> like the island of what? Lost boys. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. It's like you throw it all. <laughs> you know, it's something odd. Yeah. I used to call it the fertile crescent because I would always say, well, everything is here. You know, and every shape and size. <laughs> Did you want to say something? Well, I just also, with the way you put the doors on there, it reminds me of the children's books where you'd open things up. Well, the pop-up yeah. book. Yeah. 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 That was a surprise. Yeah. Yeah. And then you would open things up yeah. while you were reading it. And we had a place like this in Chicago called Riverview, very similar. I feel like I heard of that. Yeah. How do you know when to stop? <laughs> Say that again? How do you know when to stop when you're finished? When do you just, how do you decide when? that piece is done? Oh, you know what? That's. I'm glad you brought that up because I usually throw that into my um, talks. I keep working and um, I start feeling something where the piece tells me what it needs in the end. Mm -hmm. Like, I need another swatch of aqua there and I need another bold orange. And once it stops, that conversation of it telling me what to do, it, it finishes itself and then it's done. That's when mm -hmm. I was done. Thank you for bringing that up. Yeah. Very important. Mm -hmm. 